It is no longer news that a single stream of income cannot sustain you, yes, you and me in this country, especially if you live in Nigeria. Having multiple streams of income is no longer a luxury. It is a necessity because the bills are constantly piling up. The bills, the utility, the transport bills, the internet bills, data, everything. If you are any one stream of income, it will be as if money is coming in in one way and it is fleeing in seven ways. That is no longer meant to be so. So if you're watching this video, you should start thinking, how do I get an extra stream of income? It is a pertinent question everyone should answer and everyone should start thinking of. And yes, the expert has got you covered because on this episode of Ask an Expert, <laughs> we'll be sharing with you seven home-based business ideas that you can start from the comfort of your home and launch with little or no capital. Do you want to find out? All right, come with me. Welcome to Ask an Expert. This is a platform where entrepreneurs in Nigeria and Africa can find business related information relevant to our uniqueness as a people. My name is Mac and OBZ, M to the A to the C to the A to the double and E, and I am the host on this show. On today's episode of the show, we are going to be sharing with you seven home-based business ideas that you can start from the comfort of your home and start earning money. This is the right time for you to subscribe if you have not yet subscribed. So hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so that you don't miss out on the content we'll bring to you every week. Many people are actually interested in entrepreneurship, but most times they are afraid of saying when how can i stop my nine to five and then start up a business and then they're afraid of okay how do i get capital how do i start paying for utility paying for rent and the rest of it no and because of these fears it has limited some persons who have some ideas they want to start up as a side hustle from starting that should not limit you because um you can actually start up some businesses without having to go and pay for shop rent or having to pay for utility or even having to pay for get capital just from your the comfort of your home there are some business ideas that you can launch now we know that if you want to start a full-fledged business in nigeria the first step is to go and register your business with the corporate affairs commission please do that if you want to start up even if it's a side hustle um, your side hustle is also going to look more authentic if it is registered and you have an account tending for that. So now that you know this, I'm going to share with you quickly some business ideas that you can start from the comfort of your home. The first business idea you can start from the comfort of your home is becoming a knowledgepreneur. This is the business of selling your knowledge, your experience and a skill and your skill in exchange for payment. Consumers are hungrier now more than ever before. They are looking for someone who will show them the how. You know, it's easy to get the what and the why and the rest of it on Google, but the how. And anyone who would show up with the how, consumers will gravitate towards you. So there is something you know that someone is having headache for. There is something you can do effortlessly that comes as stressful to another person. This is the best time to start a consulting services from the comfort of your home. As a consultant, you are selling your knowledge, you are selling your experience, and you're selling your skill to get paid. So can you cook? Can you dance? Can you, can you do anything that is so unique and people are having headache towards? Come on, you can package that into a course and sell it to okay. people. So, identify that thing your friends always reach out to you for. You know, maybe there's an event happening and they be like, hey, babe, what's up? Can you come around and help me just, you know, organize this thing? Uh, maybe, you know, there's a birthday coming and say, hey, can you help me just bake? Or can you help me just do this? Can you help me just do that? Identify those things your friends are constantly coming to you to ask for. Outline them into 
content, drop a course content, package them into an ebook or a video course, upload on sites like Udemy or Combo Course and the rest of it, and guys, you can start making money. This is so true. Now, if you want to start up a knowledge preneur business, you need a skill that is an aspect of your life that you, you have mastered or you you've gained competence in so once you have that skill or you have that knowledge that people need <laughs> the next thing you need is your smartphone or your computer where you can use to record the course now you can decide to write it into an ebook publish on amazon and several other online publishing sites or you record it as a course a video course using your smartphone or using your laptop to do that and the next thing you need is an internet once you have these three things publish that course publish that ebook and sell and from the comfort of your home you can get money rushing into your account so yes go ahead and try this the second idea you can start from the comfort of your home is to become a social media manager <laughs> are you someone like me that enjoys surfing the net and you're constantly browsing and scrolling and no money is entering your account and your data is constantly burning guy you can become a social media manager now more than ever businesses and brands are coming online you know after the covid happened everyone started tilting online every business decides to start maximizing the online space but guess what these businesses this brand and busy professionals they don't have that time to sit down and start replying comment posting every time and that is where you can come in because you have the time and you enjoy surfing the net you can become their social media manager to handle their pages reply messages post content and all of that so this is something you should try out. As a social media manager, some of your job description includes creating content, email marketing, community management, graphics design, developing and implementing digital strategy, running sponsored ads, and also helping convert followers to customers. So these are some of the these are some of the duties you should perform as a social media manager now you can comfortably run this as a side hustle and you can choose who to pick from you can even manage multiple accounts of different people and different businesses you're working on your own terms you decide how much you should be paid and you decide the clients you work for and from the comfort of your home you can do this as a side hustle so you should just learn the basic skills you can go on youtube or uh, there are some sites that teach you the basic skills that you need to become a social media manager in less than one month or even within one or two weeks you can learn those skills and then become a certified social media manager and begin to push out your services to people that need them the third option you can explore to work from your home is to become a freelance writer. Becoming a freelance writer means that you are not employed by an organization, but you write and you get paid for writing. You can decide to write content for blog, write articles for individuals and organizations, and you get paid just from the comfort of your home. So this is especially interesting if you enjoy researching and you enjoy writing. This is how you can convert that your passion into something that can pay you. So go ahead and uh, you know sign up for an account on freelancing. There are lots of freelance freelance sites on the internet. We have Fiverr, we have Upwork. These are sites where you can pitch yourself as a freelance writer, get connected to those who need your services, and they pay you. So all you have to do is you know set up your account on any of these sites. Um, get testimonials from people you've written from and then keep pitching yourself for more businesses and then money comes in so make your research more about this but this is an option you can explore if you enjoy researching and enjoy writing and from the comfort of your home you can choose who you work with and also get paid for doing that have you ever recommended a product or a service to a friend Maybe they just called you up and say, hey, what's up? I need something like this. And you say, ah, go to this person. This is where I bought it from. <laughs> Guess what you're already doing? You're already an affiliate marketer without knowing. So the first idea you can start from the comfort of your home is actually to become an affiliate marketer. Everything that you've either bought, either that dress, the car, the shoe, it's either because you have seen someone wear it or you heard someone say something good about it. 
word of mouth referrals work so fast and so well and you know you know that you have been doing this unconsciously you've been doing and recommending different businesses products and services and you've not been earning any commission from that guess what as an affiliate marketer all you just have to do is to refer and recommend people's product services you know to customers and you get paid a percentage of the commission there are also affiliate marketing sites that you can sign up for and then connect all you're just doing is you're a middleman you're connecting consumers to the seller without having to go through the stress of creating the courses, creating the content. No, all you have to do is just, you know, if you're a person who loves products and you know you like marketing i think this is something you can explore you don't have the product but you connect consumers to sellers who already have the product and you get paid a certain commission you can do this for courses you can do this for products you can also do it for services so i want you to go ahead and also explore this option and you can do it from the comfort of your home isn't that interesting the fifth business you can start from the comfort of your home is to become a home-based chef. Many professionals are busy, but they enjoy, you know, having that sumptuous delicacy, that meal. But the truth is they don't have time to prepare that meal. Are you someone that enjoys cooking and you, you know you do it out of passion because you enjoy it? Guess what? You can actually fill up the gap of helping these people who are busy professionals, working class people that don't have time to cook that sumptuous delicacy. You can fill up that gap by cooking it and delivering to them and they pay you well for that. Guess what? You don't have to open a restaurant to, to, to turn your culinary skills into money-making venture. With that, your kitchen utensils that you have, that small pot, that your stove, that your gas, yes, you can do that from your home and, you know, <laughs> push it to them and they buy it. All you have to do is start with your friends and family. Reach out to them and say, oh, um, I do this. One pot of soup is this amount. One pot of soup is that amount. You can reach out to them and if they are satisfied with your service, guess what? They will become your brand ambassador and start preaching your gospel. The gospel of you being an exceptional cook. Alright? So, I, I want you to explore this. If cooking is what you want, there are people who don't like cooking. There are people who are very busy. They don't have the time but they also want that home cooked meal you can fill in that gap and um, prepare the meal deliver to them and get paid you can use what you have your current utensils to achieve this okay so i want you to go ahead explore this option and give us feedback on how it you know how it goes now the sixth idea you can launch from the comfort of your home <laughs> is backyard farming yeah have you got an extra space in your home like you have the space that is not being used do you know that you can actually convert that into a small farm and grow vegetables and other things it's simple true it's it's very true one of the easiest um farming business you can start from the comfort of your home is snail farming guys i have heard about snail farming and the money there is meadow you don't need um, a lot of capital to start up snail farming so i heard and you know it has lots of interest rates so if you have that space in your home you can also try that you know have that small farm in your backyard you grow vegetables, grow some of the simple crops, beans, maize, yam, that takes three to six months for it to, to grow. And after it is matured, you can sell it, or even use for your personal consumption. Farming is something you can also explore. That is if you have an extra space in your home. You don't have to go and start buying land or to buy a vast amount of land. No, just with that small space in your home, you can achieve this. Woohoo! Yes, we are at number seven and the seventh business you can start from the comfort of your home is hairdressing and beauty services. You know, everyone is actually concerned about their physical looks, their hair, their nails, especially even women and men, yes. So you can actually, and, and they prefer when the services is offered to them at the comfort of their home. 
so you can actually start up this business and, do, and begin to do home services to people even as a guy as a hairstylist you can have your kids this of you thinking of how do i get capital to open a shop to have my salon where i offer this service if you are into beauty or fashion you can actually meet these customers cut their hair make their nails Give them that beautiful makeup before they are going for their event and then they pay you. Just pitch yourself, show them sample of your work. With social media, it is so easy. When you put out yourself as a makeup artist, as a hairstylist, as a barber, put your contact there and say you are available for home services. And if your works are good, they will contact you. And all you have to do is go with your tools, go to their home, give that makeup, do the haircut, make the hair and you get paid so guys in conclusion these are interesting options you have to explore even if you have a nine to five you can do this as a side hustle during the weekend or you can even do it during the day so explore the options we talked about becoming a knowledge premier a social media manager an affiliate marketer a, a home-based chef just listen to that and explore a lot of this option remember multiple stream of income is the goal and you deserve to make multiple streams of income because the bills are constantly piling up so you can explore any of those options and even do them in addition to having your nine to five or simply do them during the weekend thank you very much guys if you have any question please do well to ask in the comment section and most importantly please share this video so that your friends and your family can also learn and apply and please subscribe till i come away again same time on the next episode my name is mark Hatt.